Hi, I'm Mariana with MailChimp. In this video, we'll go over how to view the content optimizer. MailChimp's content optimizer is a paid feature in your email campaign report that helps you make your email content more engaging to your customers. It compares your email content to a set of email best practices, then offers suggestions to make your copy, imagery, and layout even better for future campaigns. Today, I want to take a look at my most recent email campaign and see what the content optimizer suggests to improve the performance of my next campaign. Ready to begin? Let's dive in. First, I'll navigate to the campaigns icon and click reports. Since I have more than one audience, I'll select the one associated with the campaign I wish to view. Then I'll click view report next to my most recent email campaign. And on the overview page, I'll see a live report based on the activity of my subscribed contacts. I can see information like click tracking and performance, e-commerce tracking for connected online stores, bounces, unsubscribes, and more. And you can learn more about campaign reports in our guides and tutorials. For now, I'll return to the top of the page and click the Content Optimizer tab. When I open my content optimizer, I can see my email campaign's name along with a set of content and style recommendations. It also tells me what I did well in this email so I can keep practicing these email best practices in the future. The analysis shows the number of best practices that my email met and a total for each of four categories, skimmability, text and visuals, links and CTAs, and typography. Let's take a closer look at what each of these categories means. Skimmability reviews how easy it is to read your email at a glance. The content optimizer will count how many words are in the email and the estimated time it takes to read. I see here some suggestions to increase my skimmability score. For instance, I'll want to keep sentences under 25 words, email content under 200 words, and use smaller words. Text and Visuals analyzes the use of images and headings to create visual interest for my audience. I'll want to do things like include shorter headings and use subheadings that have a limited word count to increase my score in this category. I can also see how many images I used, as well as my average heading and subheading lengths. And the next category assesses the links and calls to action, or CTAs, included in my email campaign. Adding these to my web content or my social media can result in a higher links and CTA score. The number of links, social links, and CTAs I included in my email can be found in the campaign stats section on the left. And lastly, if I scroll down here to typography, I can see the analysis on the consistency of my font sizes and textiles. And this is important as I want to make sure that my email is professional and easy to read. The content optimizer will also review the size ratio of the headers and subheaders and how consistent the paragraph text is in the body of the email campaign. It also averages the size of the headers and subheaders and paragraph text for future review. And that's it. I now have some great suggestions on how to make my next email more engaging and easier to navigate. For more information about the content optimizer, check out MailChimp's guides and tutorials.